Nowadays, people tend to put more emphasis on data security. And to do this, many of us would choose to lock our Microsoft Word documents while working. It surely eases our worries, but at the same time can also pose some troubles when we unfortunately forget our password. But this is not the end. There is still a chance that we can tackle this problem. Want to check out what the solution is? Just continue watching. No matter the reason for forgetting your password, we're sure that you are anxious to unlock it and get back to whatever you were working on. Under such conditions, many people choose to solve it using online tools. As easy and convenient as it seems to be, many problems exist deep inside, such as data security and privacy, low unlocking rate and file size limitations. And today we'll bring you an awesome alternative, Passbar for Word. This is a desktop tool that can unlock any password without endangering the data on the file. Some of the features that make Passbar for Word a better option include the following. Firstly, it can unlock the protected Word document in various ways, including password to open and the password to modify. Secondly, it provides four powerful attack modes designed for various levels of password complexities thereby increasing the chances that you will easily recover your password. Thirdly, it is very easy to use and only requires a simple three-step process. Lastly, if you need to stop the recovery process in some situation, you can save the recovery status at any time you want. Does it sound appealing to you? Next, I will offer you more details. This is a password protected document that I am locked out of and I'm going to show you how to open it with the help of Passbar. Here we go. Step 1. Open Passbar for Word on your computer and then choose the Recover Password option to begin the recovery process. As for the Remove Restrictions option, we have talked about it in our last video about Word document. If you want to have a review, simply click the link below in the video description. Step 2. Simply click Add and then browse for the password protected document on your computer. After uploading the document you will see four separate attack modes, each designed to help you recover your password under different circumstances. Select a proper one depending on your own situation. As you can see, Combination Attack combines only the characters you choose to find the password. Dictionary Attack finds the password from inbuilt or customised dictionary and it takes less time. Mask Attack finds your password faster based on the information you know about it. Brute Force Attack tries all possible combinations and takes longer time. For myself, I remember that my password included the number 13, three letters A, P and S, but forget the way they are combined. So here, I choose combination attack. Firstly, as I don't remember the password length, so here I choose I don't know. As for the prefix and suffix, I remember that it begins by 13. About the lowercase letters, I'm sure that the password contains A, P and S, and I just skip the uppercase letter option. For numbers, I choose 1 and 3. I don't recall any symbols, so I just click Next. Check the summary to see if there is anything wrong or missed. If not, just click the Recover to continue. After that, what we need to do is wait patiently. One thing you need to note is that the more information you choose, the longer it will take because there will be more ways to combine the information accordingly. Done. Passbar made it. It's indeed an incredible password helper. Now, if you are troubled by the same issue and want to have a try, just click the download link below in the video description. If you have any advice or questions about this video or any other topics you want to see in the next video, please feel free to leave your comment. Well, that's it for today's video. Please make sure you've given us a thumbs up and subscribe to us. See you next time.